went fishing. It is pitch black out right now. Usually like a little bit of light heading in the boat, but different time of year. Um, it is uh, 56 degrees right now, which is freaking cold. So I don't know. It feels like it's always a little bit earlier and colder this time of year when you're going fishing, but we uh, we got a couple couple trips lined up here next few days um, there's been a few fish around you know it's still it's still definitely winter time fishing um, today is uh, gonna be our first day in 2020 fishing so we'll see what we can uh, what we can put on the books here and start our season off right um, I think you know when you hear a lot of people talking about seasons we kind of um, call the whole year a season so this is the start of our season. Anyways, uh, heading down to the harbor. It looks like it's going to be another one of those like crisp winter days. Usually, you got a lot of wind going on this time of year. The trades are blowing pretty hard, um, so the clouds are all all out. So it's usually like a nice, like crisp, clear day on the water. Um, and then the direction of the wind is generally that that uh, trade wind direction, which is going to be blocked by the mountains. The weather's pretty nice. We haven't fished in a few days, so head on out there, see what the current's doing, see where we, uh, see what we can find out there. All right. All right, all right. Well, first day fishing 2020. Here we are. Bright and early, winter time. A little bump on the water for calling us. Not too bad, though. But yeah, typical kind of winter you see, it's just not a cloud in the sky. A couple people out, more than usual, but it's uh, still pretty empty. Gonna be a lot of playing field out here at the moment. Gonna head down and uh, fish a little area down that way, see what it looks like, and uh, see what we can find. So hang with us. Water temp right now is about 76 degrees. Oh, damn. Why we always lie? Why we always play these games? Act like we don't care, but we know we feel the same. same. Told you last week, now nah, I thought this game was over, but now you can't remember. Can we say it when we're sober? No. Nice fish. Play that side. Just caught a spearfish, setting things up. We only had two lures out. We had the Koya tube, a little uh, Nyama out the back, and a uh, nice fish came up on the Koya tube. Missed it a couple times and then uh, came back, proper bite. Ate it, took off. It's like a decent fish. So, uh, just catching up to him. Got us in the back end pretty quick, but we're on her. And uh, first fish of 2020. Got the angle a little bit on this one. He's gaining some. He's gaining a lot now, actually. Um, and uh, looking good. Fish was kind of just trying to dive on us, so we're trying to redirect it and uh, get on top of her. So, still a little bit line out, but kicking butt. Kicking butt.
great one. That's the one. Came from Guam for that one. Oh yeah. <laughs> Shut up and fish Guam. There you go. So boys, you go to Guam, fish with this guy. Oh yeah. All right. Whew. I'm gonna call it a day now. <laughs> First spear fish and nice cone of blue. Yeah, that was excellent. On the, uh, on the Koya tube. Whew. Thanks, Eric. Second time running this thing. All right, let's go. <laughs> All right, there we go. First fish of 2020 was a good one. Yeah. Our boy Kenton's uh, commercial boat. The vicious cycle. Tuna Slayer right there. Um, yeah. Look, wintertime fishing. Always good to get a get a nice one during this time of year. So. I head home, still some waves in town. Hopefully you get the boat clean in time to go surf and call it a good day. Connor. You. Another nice crisp winter day. Caught a decent one yesterday. And uh, hoping to see if we can uh, keep it rolling. Nice job. All right, I got his. I got his. Right here. I got his. All right, here we go. It'll be able to get it eaten now. Okay, one gone. Let's get the other two. Nice job. Get in the chair. All right, one down and two to go.
How you feeling, Dale? Good. Tired. <laughs> First try, Barlin? Yes. <laughs> How about you, Sasha? Yeah, pretty awesome. All of a Two in the chair already? Two in release? The chair. Triple header, that's pretty awesome. It's in the dorsal fin. It's in the dorsal. That's why he fought so hard. Wow, lucky you. Hey, good job. He did awesome. Thank well you. done. Well the done. One, no doubt. Yeah. That one, he was hooked right in the top of that fin right there. So Sweet. Y'all want to do it again? So, yeah. Now let's get a bigger okay. one, right? <laughs> <laughs> nice job, everybody. We'll do it again. All right, we got him. Three for three. All right, guys. Well, we're just finishing up here, heading back in. Another uh, Kona wintertime day. Got a little stripe marlin action for you. And uh, do it again tomorrow. Alright, how's that? Another one. We got a trip had a triple on there for a minute. We're back to a double. I'm gonna keep this side out. We've been trolling, just trying to get as many bites as we can. So uh see if we can get some more. Give it a second more, then you can, uh, then you can take that one out. We don't really need three. I mean, we got our hands full. All right, I think we're gonna clear this right long now. We gave it a bit of time and didn't get bit on it. No need to be greedy. All right, let's go get after these two. Yesterday and today to see, but I mean, really, the 
we want a big one, you know. We're just um, trying to make it fun when we get into a pack of, the, of these little guys. But the good thing is there's there's some fish around. Um, a pair of a 500 called this morning, so we uh, it's early in the day. Just got a pair of dues. The current looks good. Cool. All right. Hopefully we'll, uh, we'll be opening up 